The sign on the door of this Jackson Heights Starbucks says there's a lot to love about the popular coffee chain, but some residents say they're not loving the trash the store regularly leaves on their residential street. It's really hard every day to walk by 15 feet of trash. People who live on 79th Street say for more than a year, Starbucks employees have been leaving piles of trash on their side street instead of putting it on 37th Avenue in front of the store. They say almost daily, garbage sits in front of their building, sometimes for 12 hours or more before it's picked up by a private trash company around 5 a.m. The Department of Sanitation says a commercial business can put trash on a street that's adjacent to their building's rear exit. However, regulation states a business cannot put out its trash earlier than an hour before closing time, in this case 10 p.m., or the business faces fines. The DOS hasn't said if this Starbucks has been fined. We've made probably almost 100 complaints to 311, to the Sanitation Department, to the Business Integrity Commission, and we have not seen any results. Clean up the garbage. Councilman Daniel Drum joined residents on Friday, calling on the store to clean up its act. We're here today to say enough is enough. We have had it, and we're going to ask people, don't patronize Starbucks until they work with the neighborhood. Many people who live on that residential block say the trash problem is affecting their quality of life, and they say they want Starbucks to become a better neighbor. We want successful businesses like Starbucks, but we want them to be fair to us. A spokesperson from Starbucks corporate office says the company has stringent cleanliness standards and says, quote, we are looking into this and making sure our standards are being followed and look forward to working with our neighbors to address their concerns. People in the neighborhood say they hope Hope the issue will finally get cleaned up. In Jackson Heights, Tamani Woolley, New York One.